Hey there, and welcome to the time-lapse assembly video of my Prusa i3 Mark 3S Plus kit. If you're looking to build one of these kits, then I would suggest to read ahead in the manual that's available online. And then if you do end up purchasing one and you are going through the build, I would say read through each one of the comments for each step as you perform them. When you go through those comments, you'll find some users have very good tips and also some minor corrections. One example of this in my case was for the linear bearings. The instructions say to just assemble them as is and use the grease that's supplied for maintenance later on. What I found in the comments was that you should indeed clean them with IPA and do a sufficient greasing. I didn't have the recommended grease on hand or the adapter for the linear bearings, so I built the kit as is, just did an IPA soak on the bearings, blew them out, and used the supplied grease to do the best that I could. It turned out to not be good enough because after only a few hours of running, I was noticing noise from those linear bearings. I went ahead and printed out the nozzle, ordered up some grease, I disassembled the printer and greased the Y and the Z axis bearings. So far, it's been quiet as a mouse. The last tip I would give is just around tools. Prusa supplies a very good set of tools that will allow you to build the kit. As seen in my time lapse, I'd recommend some kind of adjustable clutch screwdriver, some type of speed bits. The ones I use are MIP, a T-style 5.5 nut driver or something of the sort to help you hold those nuts instead of the needle nose pliers. And other than that, a nice clean area with good lighting and something that you'll be comfortable to sit down at for a while. I hope some of these tips have been helpful. I've had the printer now for a little over a month and I've already put 900 meters of filament through it for a total of over 10 days of print time. If you're not subscribed already, make sure you are because I've got upcoming 3D content including a LAC enclosure for my Prusa printer and other custom design solutions. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed.